I know you weren't expecting his wife to just call you out of the blue. Neither was I expecting to see your, your calls, missed calls, received calls, text messages, and all that stuff. I wasn't expecting to see that in my husband's phone. I don't know what it is you think I need from you in my marriage. I don't need your assistance in my marriage, honey, okay? No, 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 no. You need to stop talking and listen to me woman to woman. Whatever backed up wax you got in your ear, you need to pop it out and listen to me. I want everything I say to register to your brain. Do you understand? All the way, all over your brain, left and right hemisphere, all the, all the way to the Opogrungudu. I want it to go all the way there. No. See, I don't know if you have any kind of respect for yourself or it's just desperate measures. No, nah, seriously, I, I walked down the aisle by myself. Did you walk down the aisle with this man? No, exactly. I walked down the aisle by myself with this man. Okay, I, I took those vials, vows by myself. I knew what I was saying. I knew what I was getting myself into. I know what I was committing and obligating myself to. I did it by myself. I wore the ring by myself, okay? So you weren't part of this picture. You didn't walk down the aisle with me. He didn't put a ring on both you and I's finger. So I don't need your help in my marriage. Whatever you think you can do with him or for him, I can do it. Whatever position you think you can throw on him behind closed door, I can handle that way better than you, sweetheart. Whatever food you think you can cook for him to, to make his taste buds just wish for more, I can do better than you. I can teach you more than you think you can do for my husband. So you see, I don't need your help. Okay, I don't need your help when he's sick. I can take care of him when he's sick, okay? Okay, when he when, when he loses his job, I'm here. I'm here for better or for worse. I'm here to pay these bills when he loses his job. I'm here to have his kids and take care of his kids. I'm here to be here for him when he needs a shoulder to cry on. I'm here to be here. I'm here to be in his life in every capacity possible. When he dies, I'll be the one crying. I'm ready for it. I'll be the one to bury him. I'm ready for it. There is not a thing I need you in my marriage for. I, I never needed you. That's why you and, all, you and I didn't walk down the aisle. Where were you when he was getting married to me? Where, where were you? Why didn't you try to find him so that he gets married to you? Nobody needs your help. Nobody needs your help with anything. Whatever fashion you think you can wear, I can wear it better than you, okay? I can buy a better brand than you think you can get. Whatever heels you think you can rock, I can rock it better than you, honey. Whatever hairstyle you think you can use to attract him, my dear, I can do that better than you. So I'm just trying to say, whatever perfume, whatever thing you can do to entice, you think can entice him, I can do that better than you. I'm just simply saying I don't need your desperate help. Okay? I don't need your desperate help. Okay? So you need to stop texting my husband, calling him, trying to get his attention and all this stuff. There are a lot of fish in the water. Go go fish. Go find your fish. If you don't know how to swim, and you don't know how to get deep in the waters and find what you need, the type of fish you want, then, my dear, just stay on the shore and, 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 and kick it with all the, the shore animals, a animals and stuff. Do what you got to do. But this man, I don't need your help with him, my dear. I don't need your help with him. So I'm going to need you to excuse yourself, exterminate yourself, drop, death, do whatever you need to do with yourself. But what I don't need you to do is try to force yourself in my marriage. What I don't need you to do is try to think that I need your help with anything. No, this is my marriage. I got it. I got it. Do you understand? Yeah, you, you need to be sorry. You need to be sorry. Your Prince Charming is out there. He's growing rusty. He's all confused. He's thinking he ain't got no, nobody ever going to get married to him because you over here chasing somebody else's husband. Your Prince Charming is out there. Go find him. Go find him. He's growing gray. He's about to die from heart attack because he thinks he ain't never going to find his rib. But you his rib over here chasing somebody else's rib cage that's already occupied with a rib. Do you, do, you, do you see where I'm coming from? You're wasting time. And you definitely, and you definitely are, not, are, are not being, I don't appreciate your presence in my marriage. I need you to get lost. For real.